Good morning everybody, Saturday morning. Uh yeah, weekend. Um Michelle's just getting up now and I'm up on my bike to make us a cup of coffee and start the day. Uh a bit later on we're gonna nip out round to our friends, get in cheeses to watch the rugby. So and, and did you hear that call then? Do, do you want breakfast? The answer is do I want breakfast? Do I? Morning. Morning. How are you? Not bad yourself. Good. How do you, how do you sleep? Uh, pretty restless to be honest. I couldn't see myself. Uh, is that why you got up? Yeah, about five o'clock. Yeah. Did you sleep when you came down? Yeah. <laughs> you must have been wriggling. Oh, oh that's good. That's good. Uh, oh, that's bad. That's that's good for the bad back. That is. Not forgiving you a bad back for fixing your bad back. Anyway, we've got a few things to do. Michelle's going to make breakfast, so I'll do a little bit of ed editing and then do some domestic chores and then off out to watch the rugby. Speak to you soon. Well, that's breakfast had and we were just sitting here watching Mojo.com about the 10, what was it? 10? 10, 10, 10, 10 inventions that killed their rivals. Can, killed their rivals. Um, we've just seen Blast from the Past. We've seen Commodore, yeah. Michelle had one. I had a Commodore 64 when I was a kid. Blackberry? I had two, two Blackberries. I had the A3, A310 and I also had the Blackberry Storm. And Sega? Uh, Janet had a, a Sega Mega Drive. We were actually just commenting on how when we were kid when I was a kid I was gonna say when we were kids but when I was a kid I was in his twenties. Um, I had a Sega Mega Drive. In his twenties. Yes. Yeah. Got it for Sonic the Got it for sorry I'm I'm moving the camera about a lot. Got it for Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah. I remember thinking at the time that the graphics were amazing and if you look if you were if you were to play a Sega Mega Drive now you would you would be sort of thinking, oh my god. In actual fact, I tried to play Final Fantasy VIII. I've got a PS1, an old style slimline PS1 that I got on eBay for like 30 quid. And I can't actually play it on our television because it just comes out looking like a pixelated mess. I have to get an old CRT TV just to play it. One thing that surprised me, Gmail's killed off Hotmail. I thought Hotmail was still going quite strong. Although now it's now Microsoft Outlook, technically. I mean, I have a Gmail account now. I had a Hotmail account for years. I've, I've, I've got both. <laughs> Obviously, this vlog is, a, uh, is set up via Gmail because Google on YouTube. Uh, yeah. Just remember, reminiscing about the past there. And Michelle, oh, I have one of them, I have one of them, I have one of them. I did. And do you remember Blockbusters? I do. I had a Blockbuster card um, when I was in my twenties, early twenties. I had a Blockbuster card. That was that was when um, you were still borrowing tapes. Yes. Because I, I remember getting my first DVD. I got a DVD recorder from my flat. I must have been about twenty two. So we're going back what ten years, give or take. Yeah. And um, I got that for my Christmas from my parents. And I thought this thing was the bee's knees. And of course, you, you don't need to, to record things on DVDs. I don't even know if you can still buy a DVD recorder or not. Um, because most places, if it's most uh, tech these days has solid state drives. Yeah. Also, gateway computers. I had one of those as well. My dad, my first Pentium was a gateway PC. Yeah, killed off by Dell. Never owned a Dell. Never owned a Dell laptop in my life. I use them for work. I used to use them for work. We 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 feel it Packard where I work now. But yeah, no, I've never owned a Dell PC. We have we use Dell. My actual works Dell PC sitting over there. A Dell laptop. I had a Toshiba Satellite Pro and now I've got my Surface Pro five, Microsoft Surface Pro. Four. Four. Which is awesome and I never let Michelle get on it. No. No, I'm really looking forward to January when Alan finally gets his iMac so I can get my computer back. Yes. Yeah, well then that's when the Surface Pro will turn into a tablet. Then it will turn into my, my laptop. 
tablet, basically. It'd be like your replacement for my iPad. Yeah, since I smashed mine. Yes. Talking of which, my well, I haven't got my phone, but my phone, my Apple iPhone, did away with Michelle's Blackberry. It did. Yes. And another one, Netscape and Internet Explorer. I hated Internet Explorer for years. I've used Netscape, I've used Opera, I've used Firefox, I've used Chrome. Well, isn't Firefox Netscape? It is. Mozilla Firefox still has the, the code for Netscape. I've used Safari. I quite like Safari. A lot of people don't. Um, but I must admit, my Surface, my Surface came with um, Internet Explorer. Ten. Yeah, already on it, and I don't mind it. So, but no, for years and years and years, I wouldn't use Internet Explorer. I didn't like it at all. Um, it was just too clunky. It had too many bolt-ons. It was slow, and just ugh. Talking about adding it on a little bit. Do you remember all the other uh, internet? Uh, internet Explorer things, uh, search engines, that's one thing, it's internet search engine. Do you remember Lycos and Yahoo? I remember Yahoo. Yahoo, that's it. Yahoo. And Lycos, which had a black dog. I don't remember. I used Lycos. to use Lycos because it had a Labrador, a Labrador Retriever as an icon. Uh, that's why I purely use it because it had that. Well, my, my, my search engine of choice is Google. I think pretty much everybody uses Google now. Yeah. My Kindle has Bing built into it, and I don't like it. Yeah, I don't use Bing. Uh, only time I use Bing is when I accidentally type into Bing, when it's on, you know, because it's on the top of the Internet Explorer. But generally, they are Internet Explorer's homepage is Google anyway. So, and... One what might upset Michelle, digital cameras. I know! Digital cameras have been killed by smartphones. Really? Well, yeah, I mean, I can understand that to an extent. I mean, I know that, I mean, I'm as guilty as anyone else of taking a quick snap with my, my smartphone because my uh, Fire Phone, Amazon Fire Phone, which has been killed by Amazon because it didn't take off, um, has a really good, really great camera. Really, really great camera. Not as good as my SLR, but it's uh, it's up there. Um, but yeah, I was a bit surprised at that one. And um, nobody at all was surprised that Facebook killed MySpace. I had a MySpace, but I hated MySpace. Is it bad? I've never used it. It is. It was bad. I think, I think what made it worse was the fact that um, you could set your own layout and it, it just wasn't very intuitive to use. I, I'm not very good with HTML coding, that sort of thing. So it's sort of a case of, um, I didn't get a Facebook for, for years and years and years either. Um, it wasn't until an old friend from school came up to have coffee with me one day and she says, you should get a Facebook account, you know, and we can stay in touch and, and so on and so forth. And that was how I ended up on, on Facebook, but I'd resisted it for ages, not as long as, um, a friend of mine, Wolf, he, he didn't get Facebook until two or three years ago. Um, he resisted and resisted and resisted. And I'm like, everybody, and I mean everybody, I mean my dad's on Facebook. Um, my mum isn't though. Um, but that's, my mum's not very, um, she doesn't like computers too much. So I mean, it doesn't really bother me. She does have an iPhone though, which I find quite funny. It was a cast off, wasn't it? And she now actually uses FaceTime. <laughs> She does, yeah, she FaceTimes me. Although she doesn't realise that her iPhone can do it yet. She uses your dad's iPad. She does. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, that's a blast from the past. I'm going to have to put the camera down here because eight minutes of recording has made my arm ache. Big to you, well, let's ask that question again. So, Sweetie, who's drinking, who's driving? Entirely up to you, my love. No, folks, he's not sick. <laughs> <laughs> we shall see how it goes. Do you fancy a drink? Do I fancy a drink? Look at that bird over there, having a poo in the woods. <laughs> Ow! Oh, if you want to drink, yeah, I'll drink all the time. Okay, Michelle has just been looking on Facebook, sorry, Facebook, 
Which you come across a little story from what? Five years ago? Five years ago, yeah. Five years ago I put up on my Facebook status, I have learned that chocolate is finite. I have chocolate. Alan sees chocolate. I have no chocolate. Nothing changes. We go to work on it. We started telling it a week on Monday, honest. After I was, after my brothers visited, um, her dieting for... Florida! Florida! I bought the Halloween Horror Night tickets yesterday. And yeah. I paid for the holiday. And yeah, so... We've got our tickets to pay for, yeah, which we're paying off in chunks per month. Because tickets do come in chunks per month. <laughs> anyway, we better get on. We're late. We're going out. We're not drinking and watching the fo watching rugby football. <laughs> and here we are again at the, blue, at the dog tap. The I've brought spare batteries this time, so you stand out here and talk later. So on a score of one to ten, how painful was it when you just bang your knee on the chair? Oh, I don't know. Four. <laughs> Only it might, four. Have been, might have been a lie though. Only it, four. It could have been a nine. I was going to say that was only four. There were some pretty good amateur dramatics for a level four pin. Uh, well, I hide it well. Yeah. <laughs> you toughed it out. <laughs> I did toughed you? it out. What's to our amusement? <laughs> yeah, I am as worse. Raw side photograph is the best. Yeah, I'm glad I got rid of them glasses. Yes, we just shot Gary. Oh, Gary's just been shot. Oh, realizing no. what you can, realizing what you can do with certain remains. A battery-operated objects. <laughs> battery. Yes, remains and battery-operated objects. Frankenstein has a whole new meaning. Talk about dying hard. <laughs> <laughs> die harder. Die harder with a vengeance. Yes, we just know that you can get your uh, re husband's remains, send them away and get them installed into a vibrator. The type of vibrator for women, not the vibrator what does the rub. <laughs> well, it's just wrong though, it's not the level. Why? Well obviously somebody likes it. Why? Once you're shot of them, you want shot of them, you don't want them coming back again. <laughs> well, there you go. <laughs> you never satisfied me in life. <laughs> <laughs> but you sure are going to satisfy me in death. <laughs> Just switch it off. What's this five minutes? <laughs> <laughs> Just heard a bit of news. Gary is criticising Michelle's editing. <laughs> My editing? <laughs> Apparently you edited that bit where you put, it, put the same five minute segment in twice in the same video. Gentle, you, gentle watchers, I do not do any of the editing. <laughs> and you heard it here first. So. Anyway, the spoils of being the designated driver. <laughs> There's beer in that air box. <laughs> I'm gonna say, you see what you've got to do now. <laughs> He's dead. I'm sorry, can you, what are you laughing at? Apparently, the vibrator not only has icon access to the speakers, it also has the perfect Control. No, it's a perfume cover. So, so I say what you need to do now is so and get Alan to go. Ooh, oh, oh, that's great. Hey, oh. You can play it through the speakers. <laughs> Where's my tea? <laughs> Boys and girls, is what <laughs> vibrates a few minutes to you. 
We've decided, seeing as you were jealous of the camera, we'd actually go put you on the video blog. <laughs> I really want to break your camera. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually laughing for a. Uh, is that GoPro 4? Um, I'm not entirely sure, it's Alan, so I'm not sure. You can use it then. Use it. Yeah. You should so. buy <laughs> We are recording at the moment. No, Alan has um, a YouTube vlog. Okay. And um, so it's updated quite regularly. And we just thought we'd. Say hello and come, on, come across. <laughs> He's going to get a gimbal for it as well, so that it's a bit. Thank okay. you. Okay, we're back at Gary and Cheese's now. We've uh, returned from the brew dog, and uh, what I'm about to try is a Caledonian brewery. Brewery drunk. I haven't been drinking, honest. Three hop craft lager. It sounds Actually, that's really delicious. It sounds real good. Have you read the uh, back of it? No, due to the fact that it's on the back. Uh, that could be a problem. Yeah. Now, said, have you re read the back? And I can't read. see as though. Yeah, man. Would you like me to read the back of it? Oh, no, this is uh, the front. That's the front. It's looking up. <laughs> we have been drinking. <laughs> A solid gold lager with spicy, minty aromas, herbal, then lingering lemony flavours. Okay. That does sound good though, doesn't it? We shall let you know. This is cruelty. No, who loves carrots? This is dog cruelty. <laughs> there are burgers and chips cooking in the kitchen. A dog can obviously smell them. And it's thinking, oh, yum, 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 yum. So it goes into the kitchen, and what does he get as a treat? Vegetarian. <laughs> he gets a carrot. He loves carrots. Does he look like a guy, that, a, a guy, a dog that doesn't like carrots? I'll tell you what, time how long it takes him to eat that carrot, then give him a burger. <laughs> Do you know something? He'd probably turn his nose up at the burger. I can't. That's the first time I've seen it. Well, apart from you know when they put stuff like that in dog food and the dog doesn't know it's in there. There you go. If you want to be a dog in this household, like carrots. This is favourite. In fact, uh, Kelly was the same. She liked carrots. She liked cucumber. Into the smoky atmosphere. Is that good? Was that nice? Yeah, like that. Not by luck, but the ball came down on his shoulders. They'll be nice. testing him early on. Absolutely, new team coming in. First thing you want to do is get a ball in. Probably a very two or three fingers. Just two fingers. I'll have the little bit. Oh, they've kicked off. See, eat your carrot, try. Look at this fine spread what's been put on. We've got burgers, which are pork with uh, chilli and lime and something else. Uh, Where's the new food? That? Where's the new one you That's leaves. It's spinach. Spinach. <laughs> Beetroot. Courgette and apple. No, apple. Courgette and carrot. Tiger bread. Tomatoes and uh, rustic chips. With the skins on. And cheese! cheese. Can't beat it. Get on it! Relish. Oh, and relish. Oh, and some onion relish. Onion relish. Nah. I am going yeah. to thoroughly enjoy this feast burger. I'm <laughs> a Nora. Burger? Mm. But it's a bit warm, is it? <laughs> no, no. I'm laughing at Alan. Burger. Mega stack burger. Sorry, I forgot. Mega stacked cheeseburger. <laughs> this is uh, D side APA, 3.8% volume, uh, water, hops, barley, and wheat. So, very simple ingredients. It says uh, deep golden American pale ale has clean fruity flavours and zest a character from American aroma hops. American. 
Yeah. APA. Never had it. I'm going to compare before. Well, there we go. This is new and uh, body, bitter, fruit. So it has this like a spider scale, which I don't know that you can see. Uh, so it gives body, fruity, hoppy, malty, sweet, or bitter, and it, and it gravitates between where it is the most. So hoppy and fruity is the most seconded by bitter and uh, oh, between body and malty and the last so um should be interesting i must admit i'm quite intrigued okay well, let's get have a drink and see what it tastes like that's us home now saturday over with been quite a good day got a little bit of a beer headache uh but it's enjoyable as for the rugby who got the prediction right? Well, Ireland won 35 to 25, so mine and Gary's prediction weren't right. Michelle's was the closest. Okay, I'm gonna call it now. It's been a long day, very tired. So it's time for us to get off to bed and snuggle up and rest and see what tomorrow brings. Okay, so good night. Speak to you tomorrow.